All right, so now that Twilio is complete, let's move over to Mailgun. Now, before we do that, setting up Mailgun is a bit trickier than setting up Twilio because uh, we have to do a few more things. Just uh, like we saw in Twilio, it, it was just copying over two keys and that's it really, that's, uh, that's done. Also, Twilio offers free plan, which is really good to start. But Mailgun is a bit difficult, I would say, because it, it off although it offers a free plan, you cannot do really much with it with high level because uh, let 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 me show you so I have this I have this this package over here which is the trial zero dollars per month which is good and I can also send five thousand emails the problem is I cannot send emails from my own domain email which is my professional email so for me to do that I need to be able to connect that domain in this case it would be ashaseep.com this domain needs to connect with my mailgun and mailgun needs to be connected with high level that case only I I will be able to send out emails from my high level with haseeb at ashaseep.com or info at or contact at ashaseep.com so this this package won't allow me to do that also one of the one of the biggest problems with this package is we cannot receive emails into high level accounts if we use this package so we have to use we must use at least this package and this this has got pretty much everything you need to use with high level like it, it like as you can see it gives you 50000 emails per month and if it, it it gives you domain connections which i will show you how to connect the domain with mailgun it gives you sending, receiving, and all sorts of validations and other stuff. So if you are using high level and if you're using Mailgun with high level, it's recommended that you go with this package. Now, although I have signed up for a free plan, I will show you how to, uh, how to connect Mailgun with high level with, a, with an account that has a paid plan because otherwise I wouldn't be able to show you what happens when you connect uh, paid mailgun account so before I connect the mailgun uh, the paid mailgun with my high level account let me show you something so what you need to do is when you buy the the $35 per month package from mailgun you are gonna have to connect the API keys with that uh, with your high level account from mailgun so for that you come to dashboard you go to API keys which is just similar whether it's paid or free it doesn't matter really so this is the private API key you need to connect with your high level account so I'm gonna connect to the other account so the API key for my paid mailgun account would be once I connect that key over here, it's going to give me all the domains that I have connected with my that Mailgun account. So let me copy that over. So now you can see it gives me the drop downs, although I, I think it would be blurred when it goes out online. So but you, you can see that there are two domains and I what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you in the other video how to connect these domains with your Mailgun account though, so they start showing up here so you can connect Mailguns uh, your your domains and uh, with your your sub accounts so it's I, I know it's still a bit confusing but the confusions will go away uh, like but regarding the domains the confusions will go away when when we start using the sub accounts like when we use uh, when we start using go high level and the sub account level so yeah although it's a, a little bit tricky and confusing here i'd recommend you just go with the flow see you in the next one